How you doing? I'm Big D. Welcome to my show, String Them Up. So, <clears throat> I want to talk about what does Yingbei Malmsteen think about Led Zeppelin's Jimmy Page? Or what his opinion is? A lot of people believe Yingbei is probably one of the best guitarists ever. But Jimmy Page is amazing as well. So the Swedish virtuoso guitarist, Yngwie Malmsteen, achieved success in the 80s playing in the hard rock group Stellar and Alcatraz. Later started a successful solo career known for his incredible playing technique. The musician gave his opinion on many musicians over the years. One of them is being Led Zeppelin's Jimmy Page. So an interview with Music Radar back in 2019, Malmsteen listed 10 guitarists. That impressed him. And one of the, the ones that impressed him the most was Jimmy Page. He says, well, I did a tribute thing to Jimmy, Jimmy Page along with L.D. Miola years ago. I like him because he was very broad view. He had a very broad view and for a guitar player, understanding their songs as a whole. I really like the experimenting they they started doing later on. And a lot of those classic recordings were done with a Telecaster. I heard about what new Fender reissue. I have, he said he had to get one, which he has received one probably a very short time after this uh, interview. He said, which reminds me which reminds me there's also a new Malmsteen 30th anniversary model coming out soon. It's done. They've sent me four prototypes, which are sick. The main difference is it has a maple cap, a 68 style neck, and different colors. So I'm really proud of that. And the fact is, it's my 30th anniversary too, of course. And I'm still here. I am a huge fan of Malmsteen. Don't get me wrong. But he has to be the most arrogant person, not just a guitar player, but he has every right, doesn't he? Melmstein likes Jimmy Page, but when asked in an interview with Guitar World back in 2014, which one he preferred, Page or Jimmy Hendrix? The, the guitarist answered, I love Jimmy Page, but Hendrix, he's a, a little dear to my heart. He also asked to choose between Hendrix and Stevie Ray Vaughan. And he said, that would definitely be Hendrix. Stevie Ray was great too. But if it wasn't for Jimmy, nobody would be sitting in this room. And I do agree. But when asked to choose between Led Zeppelin and Black Sabbath, the guitarist answered Deep Purple. He played Jimmy Page's replica guitar, Dragon. The guitarist played in 2021 during a question and answer session on his social network, the replica of Jimmy Page's Dragon Telecaster model, which was pretty sick too. After being asked by a fan if he owned a Telecaster guitar, the musician is famous for using the Stratocaster model. I actually do have one. This is the one here. It's the Jimmy Page model. I just got it. 
So let's see what it sounds like. This doesn't have any scallops and it doesn't have any stack pickups. So I, it feels different. There it is, Jimmy Page. To celebrate Led Zeppelin's 50th birthday, Fender decided to release a line of guitars back in 2019 inspired by the iconic designer, designed by Jimmy Page. Ingve was born in Stockholm, Sweden, back in 1963. And at the age of 10, he formed a track on Earth. His first band that was that only had him and his friend from school playing in playing the drums. He released 22 studio albums in a career spanning over 40 years. His first solo album, Rising Force. Released in 1984, was the Guitar Players Award the best rock album and was nominated for a Grammy Award for Best Rock Instrumental, reaching number 60 on the Billboard album chart. Back in the 80s, I was in my mid-teens. A lot of people didn't know Melmstein until BAM! It hit the scene, which... If you were into metal, or at least some hard rock, you knew pretty much who Melmstein was. I wanted to talk about Melmstein because he's had some harsh comments to say about some guitarists. Some guitarists that uh, many of us think are great, great guitarists. One of the pieces that uh, Malmsteen picked to pick apart Kurt Hammett's um, guitar playing was his notes that he picked. I don't see, in my opinion, if Kurt Hammett, Kirk Hammett picked other notes, could it have been better? Better songs? I mean, Metallica is awesome. They are probably the very first band comes to mind when I hear someone say, what's your favorite metal band? By far, my, my opinion, growing up in the 80s, Metallica was my favorite band. When it comes to commercialized type bands, though, um, Metallica didn't become a commercialized band until the 90s, my opinion. But if you want to talk about commercialized bands... I would have to say Van Halen. Eddie Van Halen, speaking of. God rest his soul. Amazing guitarist. He made, just like Jimi Hendrix, he made many guitar players think. He made many guitar players better. Well, thank you for checking out my show. I do appreciate it. Um, I'm going to try to have more shows up. I'll try to do at least one a week. Maybe more. Uh, I'm presently in the middle of a Les Paul build. I hope you're interested in checking that out. Um, try to have a great rest of your day. God bless America.